Are you sure you know what you're doing, George? Of course I know what I'm doing. That's what you said on our honeymoon. <laughs> Understand, Helen told you about me starting my own business. Oh, yeah, and we're really happy for you, Tom. What are you calling your company? I'm naming it after myself. Honky Publications. George! <laughs> Give me a dry shirt. Uh, yasa, Massa. <laughs> uh, George, uh, may I have a word with you? Sure. I hope it's goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I just love your sense of humor. <laughs> But seriously, George, you know, I've always admired you for your uh, business abilities. Oh, you have? <laughs> sure, well, just look at you. You're a big success. Yeah, well... And you made it happen because you have what it takes. You got brains. No. Uh, I mean, yes. <laughs> but uh, more important, you've got guts. That's right. Because you're not afraid to take a risk. That's right. Oh, you're not afraid to give someone a helping hand when he asks for it. Damn right. Oh, thanks, George. I knew I could count on you. Oh, hey, hey. boy. What's going on? <laughs> George said he co-signed for my loan. Well, you know how to get so... Loan? <laughs> what loan? Well, the loan I need to start my company. Here. All you have to do is co-sign. No I... way. What? Why should I co-sign for somebody who comes to my house and insults me? I didn't insult you. No, you didn't, but your wife did, and until she apologizes... Apologizes? <laughs> George, you started that argument with Helen. Right, and I'm finishing it. Bye, Willis. <laughs> George, I'm sure Helen didn't mean what she said. What did she say? <laughs> she called me a stupid little narrow-minded fool. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, I'm sure she's sorry. George, why don't you help Tom get the money he needs? He's a responsible person. I know he's a responsible person. That's why he's responsible for what his wife said to me. Okay, George, if Helen apologizes, will you co-sign for the loan? Yeah, okay. If she comes down and apologizes for calling me a stupid narrow-minded fool. Stupid little narrow-minded fool. <laughs> what? Oh, that's what she said, not me. <laughs> Excuse me, Louise, I have to go talk to Helen. George, I don't think that's right. Look, Louise, this has got to be the right plan. I mean, making Helen apologize to you before you co-sign. Look, Louise. That's the way business works. If somebody wants something from you, they gotta pay what you're asking. Ah! Oh, I think I got it loose. Well, I don't think it's right. And if I... Oh! Oh! <laughs> I have your ring for you in a minute, please. What? Oh! Uh, George, uh, maybe it's not in there. Say what? Uh, I'm not sure I dropped it down the drain. What the hell you mean you're not sure? <laughs> you were sure before. Uh, George, I wasn't sure. I could have left it somewhere else. Or maybe I forgot and put it in my apron before I washed the dishes. <laughs> Sucks it could be anywhere. Oh, yeah. Well, I have been breaking my tail just anywhere for the last hour. If it ain't here, you're gonna be putting this stuff back together yourself. Oh, but George... Uh, Louise, I what just about got this drain pipe off. Uh. Hey! <laughs> oh, that's wonderful. I told you I knew what I was doing. Oh, <laughs> 